This is the second lesson in a series intended to help you find records about your ancestors who lived in Italy using the Family Search Research Wiki. The vast majority of the research you do in Italian records will use just two record groups, civil registration and church records. Civil registration records are the births, marriages, and deaths that were recorded by the government. In some parts of Italy, they began in the early 1800s. In Sicily, they began in 1820. But by 1866, all the provinces in Italy were keeping these records. Church records also record births, marriages, and deaths. The birth records are in the form of baptism records because of infant baptism. These started much earlier in the 1500s. In your particular area, you will want to see when civil registration starts. And from that point, you will do all your research in civil registration. However, you might use church records to fill in the gaps. Before civil registration starts in that area, you will only have church records to work with. You will find the province page that you need by going to this URL that takes you directly to the Italy genealogy page, then scroll down and find your province. The URL will be listed in the notes below the video. Here is the Italy genealogy main page, and I'm going to choose the province of Prato. I'm just going to give you a quick overview of all of the items you would find on a province page. Here is a quick review of the definition of civil registration, the dates that it covers, and the kind of information you would find in it. Next, you will find a listing of the links to online civil registration records. Some towns in Prado will not be listed in that collection. By looking in the Family Search catalog, you might find that there are microfilms of them, and in many cases, those microfilms will have been digitized. In the event that no online records are available, you will need to write to the municipal office of the town to ask them to look for the records. Here is a link to the address list for all the municipalities. And here is a letter writing guide to help you write the letter in Italian. The next section of the province article will give you a brief explanation of church records. Right now, only a very few church records are available online. As more and more of them become available, you will find them in the family search catalogs, so check back frequently. For some records, you will need to write to the Catholic priest. This link to the Catholic directory will give you the address for the church, and again, you will use the Italy letter writing guide. Once you find the record, you will probably have to read it in Italian. This link to the Italian genealogical word list will give you the whole vocabulary that you need for reading genealogical records. There are also several online lessons available in reading these records including this third one, which will have sample records that you can practice on. Think of this Italy province page as a kind of a kit that has everything you need for that province. It will have all the links you need to find records and all the help that you need for reading them. Now you try it. Find the province page for the town where your ancestors lived. Look and see if there are civil registration online records available. Study the time period that they start. Are they indexed, or will you have to search through images? Next, check the Family Search catalog for the town. See what records have been microfilmed and whether any of those are available in digital form. From the province page, practice finding the contact information for the municipality and for the local Catholic Church.